What is up guys, Zack Scott here playing Plants vs. Zombies 2 and today is going to be all about the brand new plant, the Red Stinger. Red Stingers fire shots at full force when close to home and become more defensive the further from it they get. Flexibility is of key importance to Red Stinger. I do stretching ex exercises every morning, he says. It's important to stay mentally and physically nimble. So. Uh, he is a, a plant that has a variable purpose depending on where he's planted. We're going to showcase him throughout the eras here. We've already kind of done that on uh, the Lost City. And this is a new plant particular to the Lost City. So we have probably a few stages to go through. More than a few, really. We have several stages to go through. Let's try Ancient Egypt. We'll try to power through these relatively quickly. And um, we, we'll see how useful the Red Stinger is. First, we're going to do the Pinata Party. That's right. We have a brand new Pinata Party to do. Uh, to usher in uh, Lost City Part 1, of course. Uh, so let's see what we got. We have a lot to deal with. Let's do it. I'm ready. Let's have the conveyor belt stage. I'm just going to start dropping these out like ASAP. I don't even really care about the place, but this is four waves. Holy moly. All right. Well, um, hopefully we can do a good job here. I think we can. Uh, sure, do that. I don't know. Here we go. Okay, he's going all the way over to the other side. That's crazy. But we got it. We know what we want. We know what we need. All right. Stop him all from doing anything. Don't eat him. Don't eat him. Don't eat him. Don't eat him. I think he's going to eat him. Okay, that's fine. Tore right through. Got a whole column now of these guys. This is good stuff. I don't really know what else we want to do, but this looks good to me. Um, I know that we're going to have to do something crazy like that right now just to kind of unleash. Take out a bunch of them. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, this is going to be a fairly quick, I think, a fairly quick uh, pinata party. Um, here we go. Just burn them. Burn them. You know what I'm saying? All right. Beautiful work, if you ask me. Very cool. All right. Come on now. Stop eating through everything. We got this pinata party on full, full lockdown mode. We got it. We got it. How many more can we do? Just drop them all out as soon as possible. We're trying to get everything done quickly and not at all. Uh, yeah, yeah, we, we got that. I mean, this is good. This is good. We got it. We're done. We're done. That was an easy pinata party, but we're going to show off the red stinger, and we're just going to click five gems. Yes, again. Five gems. Love it. All right. Moving on. Red stinger time. Going to showcase them all throughout the various eras of Plants vs. Zombies 2, starting with Ancient Egypt, uh, ending probably at uh, Frostbite Caves. Oh, dear. So, so much to do. Uh, so, Red Stinger, how useful is he in Ancient Egypt? That's a great question. Um, I, assume, I assume that this guy is pretty versatile. He can he can be useful in, in almost any situation. Let's bring him into level 17. And uh, I hope this is a decent stage to do. All right, never have more than 14 plants. Got it. This is what we typically do. Um, so, I'm going to bring in the sunflowers. More, more of those, please. Um, we're going to boost everything here. Let's see what we got. Red Stinger. Ice, of course. Ice, Ice Baby. Uh, the Red Stinger, of course, is going to be the crux of this here. This is going to be a very important thing to have. Um, yeah, more ice. More ice-related things, maybe. Let's rock and roll with this and see how we do. Red Stinger, how you doing? You holding up? Hope so. We're going to start putting down the um, the flowers ASAP as soon as this happens. We can't have more than f so 14 plants. so It's kind of a bummer here because uh, I'm going to freeze them here. Maybe I'll just go with a couple of sunflowers. I don't know. Sure. Let's go. Let's go a little bit slower. 11 plants left. All right. There 
right, we're still doing great, I think. Let's keep these red singers going, though. We gotta tear down these graves and whatnot. All right, All right. I think this is this is happening pretty well. Seven plants left. We're gonna go ahead and go, let's go economy over everything right now. Okay, okay, this is where it starts getting dicey. We got a, got a lot to worry about, that's okay. We only have one wave here. Let's fast forward a little bit. There we go, red singers everywhere. Here we go. Two plants left. Let's dig them up, see what we got. All right. Two left, we're gonna go with the ghosts. All right, I think this is gonna be pretty solid. This is, uh, this is a good day for red stingers everywhere. Let's go in with this. One left. There we go. One left again. I think we're well protected right now. Two left. All right, good job, guys. Good job, good job. Red Stinger successful on Ancient Egypt. So, uh, pretty pretty basic plant. It's kind of a variation. Not really planning any defense or anything. We were limited to the number of plants we can have. But let's try a stage, perhaps, on uh, Dead Man's Booty that's not so limited. We'll, we'll try and see what we got. And then, uh, but we did that objective just fine. Uh, I, I say Dead Man's Booty, I mean the Pirate Seas. The Pirate Seas, we'll see how we do on the Pirate Seas. I'm genuinely curious. We have 73 gems, which is a great number. Pirate Seas, how are you, buddies? Let's go in and see. Pirate Sea. Now, actually, the Pirate Seas is one level that I... Gosh, I wish for freaking forget the level number. Is it 22? 23, 21? Gosh, I never remember. Let's try 20, this one. Let's try this one. Yes, this is it. Plan to defend and defeat the zombies. This is the uh, this is the stage that I just love testing this out on, and I think with uh, with these it's gonna be good. Red Stinger, maybe we'll have another one. Um, what would be good other than Stinger? Spike rocks could be good. Anything temporary. These guys could be good. Squash could be good. Uh, we're primarily gonna go with Red Stingers though. And maybe this, this, I don't even know. This, okay, let's rock. With this being primarily red stingers, we're gonna see exactly how this works. All right. Let's see if just all red stingers works. That would be an interesting thing. All right, hold on. Um, let's dig them up. I don't know. Let's rock with this. See what happens. I'm genuinely curious with just this what happens. He's a little more defensive. Nice. Tore right through him. All right. Interesting for sure. So many of these things though, unfortunately. I imagine it's gonna get pretty uh, pretty crazy very soon. Put a new one in. Put a new one in. And it's just a matter, can we hold them can we hold these off, you know? Can we hold all these off? I'm gonna say no. Again, this is a level that I do just to test things out. Yeah, totally missed out on some of these opportunities here. All 
right, so I'm gonna say probably no. This isn't gonna work. That's all my coins right there. That is like literally all my coins. So no, this is probably not gonna work. We're probably gonna lose. Yeah, so didn't quite work how I planned. That's okay. Let's go ahead and exit. Uh, now that we know how that worked out, let's go ahead and exit. We'll go into the next era. That's just a level I, I like to try out individual plants to see how well they can hold off on that type of thing. So I'm glad I tried it out, but honestly, I don't think it's it's suited well suited for it for just that level. Wild West is next. Let's go into Wild West and see. We'll do a relatively easier stage, I think. We'll do uh, like maybe level 10 and uh, see what we're up against in the Wild Wild West. Okay, chickens. Chickens are definitely dicey. We're gonna go ahead and bring in uh, these guys. Ice. Power lilies boosted like that. The red stinger, of course. Uh, maybe, yeah, let's bring in some lightning reeds here because we don't want to mess with all these, do we? No, we don't. Uh, and then on top of it all, there we go. I think we're ready. I think we're ready to handle this. So let's, uh, let's do it. We're gonna want a very solid column of flowers somewhere. Starting here. This is day 10, only one wave, so. I'm gonna go ahead and freeze everybody here. Move that down, because I'm sure a red singer is gonna go in. There we go. Well covered, I imagine. All right, yikes. Okay, we're ready to fight. Let's fight him. All right. Oh boy. Um, red singer right there. We don't have any limit on where these things go, so let's just uh, be careful about it. You know, I'm gonna go and freeze him immediately. I'm not quite ready to deal with that yet. Here. Um. All right, all right. We're handling it. We're handling it. This is good. This is good. We're handling this as best we can. No, don't leave. Oh dear. Um. All right. You're still solid, right? All right, everyone freeze for a second, because I'm not, if I'm not happy, no one's happy. It's a saying, right? I think the Red Singer's holding up quite well. Especially when I start throwing in these, uh, these lightning rods and whatnot. Everyone freeze! I think a large part of the success is indeed due to the Red Stinger's placement here. Let's start building them up a little bit higher because this is going to be more of a blocking power than anything else. Let's keep him out here. Keep blocking. Freeze everybody. I guess including the chickens a little bit, huh? There we go. Keep it up with the red stingers. These guys are blocking. Now these are like full blockers here. As you can see, we're, we're really showcasing the variable, uh, the variable powers of the red stinger. From him being a, a blocking agent to him just being a straight up assault. Move him down. We can totally take these guys out a little bit better. Got it, got it. All right, Wild West Day 10 complete. Next, we're moving on to the far future, but we have a uh, Yeti to take care of. So let's go ahead and just do the Yeti stage, whatever it is. We'll try to bring in the Red Stinger. And then uh, hopefully things will go well. This is going back a notch. Then over here, far future. Here we go. 
Uh, and here it is, play level. I don't know if I get to use the red stinger here, but if I, you know, it could be cool to see. Survive and protect the endangered plants. I can do that. Ooh, the citrons are up here. Uh, red stingers might come in handy, of course. Um, I don't think we need any extra tiles. I'm going to imitate the plant food. And I'm going to bring in the red stingers, of course. Anything to protect, survive, protect, all that stuff should be good. And then, um, going to, again, see what is going to work against these guys. The EMP might work as well. Uh, would be good to bring that in, I would believe. And there's a Yeti here wearing a cool futuristic visor. I like it. All right. And then a uh, laser beam might work. Here we go. Except, I don't know. I don't feel like I'm going to be using laser beam much. Let's fast forward. We can do this. We got this. I'm sure we do. Yeah, we got this. I know we got this. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, please finish those guys off without me having to do anything. Thank you. I'm just struggling to survive here. Here we go. Uh, Red Stinger in the back. Sure. Thank you for finishing those guys off. Now, Red Stingers are going to have to go in the front, too, eventually. It's just a matter of time. There we go. I really don't even know what, what to expect at the moment. These guys are ready and primed and ready to go. Oh, dear. Uh, can I... All right. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, dang it. We probably already lost it. Oh man, can I retry and will the Yeti still be there if I retry? Because I let him I let him eat it unfortunately. Retry, let's see what we can do. What's gonna happen? Continue onward. Yes, the Yeti's still here, that's good news. Okay, we got the flowers, we got the ice. We got that imitated. We have the red stinger coming in, of course. Uh we have Maybe a walnut or two, I don't know. But it's technically the Red Singer should double as a walnut-like ability, I would think. Uh, maybe this, maybe the uh, EM Peach. And, oh, maybe the Infinite. That would be really good. Let's rock with this, here we go. Infinite could prove to be useful here if we can get one off. I do have power-ups that need to be used. I don't know if I'll be using them today, but. There we go. This is how we're gonna do it, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, indeed. Oh dear, okay. Oh dear, come on, more. Freeze everybody, we're gonna boost it again, nice. I actually don't want that flower there anymore. Here we go, this is gonna be great, this is gonna be wonderful. Ian Peach it though, shut it down. Middle is totally, totally fine. We got this though, don't we? Freeze him, can the Yeti be frozen like that? I wanna say yes. I wanna say it's gonna be A-OK -okay, in fact. Right. I think this is good progress at the Yeti's lunchbox. All right, let's hope for the best. Keep on hoping for the best. Oh God. Freeze everything really quick because uh, this is disastrous, really.
All right, this should be solid. This should be everything we need for this, I would think. This is good stuff. This is good stuff. I'm pretty sure we got it. We got it. We got it for sure. All right. All right, this is pretty fantastic. Good outcome overall. Got him, got him. There we go, Far Future Day 15, and that uh, includes, of course, having uh, getting the Yeti's lunchbox. So we have some extra power-ups there. What is next? Well, now we, we try to, yeah, thank you. It's some coins, yeah. All right, well now we try to take this on to the next area. And what does that mean for us? Um, well, that means for us, the Dark Ages. So we have uh, three more. Dark Ages is, of course, always the worst. I'm gonna do a, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna do something a little less powerful this time. I always jump right in. Let's do level 11. Uh, if there are gestures here, he's obviously not going to be a great thing for the gestures. There, there, whatever. He's going to be horrible against the gestures. That's the thing. Like, he's not good against the gestures because he shoots things. If anything, we'll have to use him almost strictly as a protection base, which might show off his versatility. So, uh, let's go ahead and bring in the sun shrooms. Let's bring in everything that's cheap. We're going to bring in the laser beans, of course. I feel like those are going to be our best shot. Not really stopping these guys. But we'll try to block them off here. Maybe we'll try to push these guys back a little bit. And then, of course, um, yeah, sure, whatever. Let's rock with this. I don't even know. I should have brought in a Grave Buster. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Let's restart. I need a Grave Buster. Sorry. I forgot about the whole mechanics of this level. We need a Grave Buster. I would love a laser bean, of course. Maybe even a, well, no, we should be good. Okay, this, 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 those three for sure. Laser bean, these, these mushrooms, no, not that. Okay, there we go. Oh boy, um, we're showing off the red stinger. Might as well bring him along for the battle. And then, um, the grave buster. That's what we need. Let's rock and roll. I'm pretty sure we got this then. Here we go. Sure, just drop it down wherever, it doesn't matter. Here we go. What else do we want? I think we have this in general. Come on, Grave Buster, you know it. You know you want it. All right. Good work, buddy. I don't know about this, let's find out. Here we go. Freeze him right there. This should be a little bit easier. We will have to deal with those guys spinning around and that's gonna be super annoying and that's why we're gonna want the laser beans in place for when that happens. As well as the ghost peppers. All right, let's see what we got. Now here's the thing, we're ready, we're right, we're ready for this, right? We're lucky to have this, right? And the cool, actually, you know what the really cool thing about this is? Is that these guys double as laser beams, essentially. That's something I completely forgot about. 
Let's freeze everyone, because I don't like dealing with them. So let's freeze everyone. And look, we're taking out the gesture with the laser beam. And that's the thing I just forgot. These things might be better for Dark Ages than I even realized initially because of the whole laser aspect of them. That is so cool. So let's uh, let's deal with that right now. Let's freeze everybody really quick. And you can't spin. If you can't spin, you can't, you know, you can't deal. You can't, you're fine. You're dead. There we go. That's the lesson I just learned. You can't spin, you're fine, you're dead. All right. Boom. Okay, now, now maybe I might need something else here. I'm gonna take these guys out really quick. Gotcha. Now freeze him. There you go, that's what we're gonna be working on right now is learning how to freeze those guys. And then of course, uh, deploying anything that we can to help. Boom, frozen. You wanna build a snowman. Sure you do. Okay, let's keep up with the uh, blocking abilities of these guys. Also keep up with the mushrooms here. I'm gonna probably do whatever it takes to win this. All right, freeze him. He's otherwise gonna destroy me if I don't. All right, go ahead and let this guy be taken out. Brave Buster on this. Freeze everyone, yes. That's the main thing about the stage. I, I, just, I guess I didn't fully understand how just helpful that freeze is. That's a very helpful freeze ability. And we're putting these things down as quickly as possible. They're a bit of a blocking uh, agent, so to speak. This seems to be working out okay. All right. I think these are going just fine. Okay, freeze them again. There we go. Keep it up. Keep up the good work. You're doing great. All right. How do I want to handle this overall? I think we're doing great. Oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me. Freeze. Keep up the big freeze. I'm actually doing a good job here and that makes me happy. The Red Singer is actually a very versatile plant, an all around good plant, especially with his boost that basically turns him into a laser beam temporarily. Well, that's 9-11 of Dark Ages. Now we get to move on to Big Wave Beach, and that's something I'm excited about a little bit. Uh, but not really. <laughs> All right, so let's try out the Red Stinger on Big Wave Beach. I really don't know how head to, I, I don't know how useful the Red Stinger is gonna be on the particular beach stage, but I'll do my best to find out. Big Wave Beach, come on, let's do it. I'm ready to see what it's like. All right. Let's go with like a typical level, level 13, something like that. Nothing too difficult. Because when you get more into the advanced stages, it's gonna be uh, never more, okay, I can do that. I can do that, I think. All right, we're not really dealing with anything super hardcore here either, so let's bring in this. Gosh, I'm just bringing those guys. We're bringing the boosts. Imitate it, come on, because we want a lot of them. And then, sure, yeah, we're gonna bring in these guys. Whatever, lily pads are gonna be useful too. And then the star fruit, I think, is always gonna be useful in general. Along with what? I don't know. Along with, uh... yeah, I really don't know. I don't know. I can't figure it out right now. Oh, how about a? Uh... Sure. If we if we end up making that much money, we'll just start using it frivolously. Frivolously. Oh, there's there are going to be no. Okay, I, I get it now. There are going to be no um, certain places to put these. 
But there goes the place right there. Four waves here, yikes. Now that is a little discouraging. Four waves of this. I'm gonna put that there, just to protect it a little bit. Oh boy, we gotta produce a lot of sun. So let's do it. Let's do it. Get him, got him good so far. I gotta get all my economy out here though. That's like the most important part to me. It's just, what? Oh no, never had more than 16 plants. Oh geez, I don't know. I, okay, retry, I don't know how this is gonna happen then. I'm gonna try it though. Never have more than 16 plants, by golly. That's gonna be very tough. But we're gonna still try to produce all that sun. Jeez, I don't even know. The red singer may not really shine here. That's the one thing I'm worried about. It may not shine at all. Uh, okay, well, mm, we're still gonna need the lily pad. Let's go ahead and uh, imitate that lily pad. This is always good. Well, the red stinger, of course, what we need. Um, star fruit, whatever. I don't even know, man. How about instead of star fruit, we put in. Um, well, you know, man, the cool thing about something like uh, this would work, Rotobega, because he flies. He doesn't have to worry about a lily pad. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do it like this then. Isn't anything that doesn't have to worry about a lily pad is gonna be golden here. Let's rock. Man, every more than sixteen plants. Jeez Louise, I just realized what that means for us. I, I don't even fully understand what it means. I'm going to try my best to have a bunch of flowers up here. I can't believe this is four waves. That's ridiculous. That's not too much sun to have to produce, though, is it? I don't want to think so. Dig it up. Oh boy. There are four plants left. This is very risky, by the way. Got him. Two left. One left. Got him. Nice. One left. I'm trying to manage this the best I can. It's going to be tough. Got him. Oh man, don't meet those guys. Two left. All right, we reached our mo monetary goal here. Here. I got him. Stopped him cold in his tracks. Oh dear. Okay. We may not be ready for this fully. Oh 
Oh. Right, one space left right now. No oh, god. Thankfully he's been decapitated. Four left. This is too brutal. This is too brutal to take care of. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh dear. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yep, that was not fun to see play out, but we have five left. Oh my goodness, this is a very intense stage. Two left. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, come on, you gotta be kidding me, man. What the heck? What the heck? All right, we're trying here. We're really trying. Three left. Oh, jeez. Boost it, boost it, yeah. Oh, no, we're gonna lose another lawnmower. All right, that's fine. We haven't even hit the final wave yet, though, which is very unfortunate. At least I think it is. We're gonna see what happens when this finally explodes, though. Oh dear. All right, so it's fine if that one loses. We lost a bunch of lawnmowers trying to prove that the red stinger is useful here. I don't think it's that useful here, honestly. In Big Wave Beach, no, I don't think so. We barely, we barely survived that one. That was very tough. So, we're moving on to the next level. Here we go. Uh, and this will be the finale uh, of the, today's video. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you for every like and favorite. This has been a video showcasing the Red Stinger's capabilities. Uh, we are going to now go into Frostbite Caves, which, again, I don't know how useful the Red Stinger is going to be here, but we're going to try it out. And uh, I feel like he's more useful, you know, the further back you go. Let's do like level 17 or something and see exactly what we need to do. I'm curious about it. I really am. Um, you know, um, let's do sun shrooms. I almost feel like sun shrooms will be a little bit better, at least initially. And then we're going to, of course, do this boost thing. Mm. What else do we got to deal with, though? Um, these guys are going to be big. That much is true. Charge guard could be useful. We need something to uh, thaw these guys out. This looks good. This no, no, not the ice. Why am I bringing the ice? Why am I even considering the ice? Let's bring that. Here we go. Actually, let's bring a hurricane. No, let's bring that. Okay, this should be good. Should be, I guess. I don't know. We'll find out. It's gonna be tough, I'll tell you that much. What I'm gonna try to do here is uh, put in yeah, we're going to do this. There we go. That might work. All right. Good work. Good work. So far, so good in my opinion. Go ahead and defrost that guy a little bit. I don't know if this is enough mushrooms or what, but I'm guessing no. Um, sure. I feel like a little... Uh, 
I don't know. We'll find out exactly how this goes, but I feel like... Don't worry, we'll, we'll, we'll get some more guys in soon. Soon is the keyword here. The operating word is soon. We'll have another... Uh... Alright, that was a good move. I think we're halfway through day 17. We're getting all these plants here, and that's wonderful. Let's go ahead and defrost that really quick. Alright, he's getting rid of my fume shroom, which is sad. But maybe necessary. Take it back. There you go. What else are we doing here? What else are we doing here? Alright, so far so good then. This is wonderful. We're actually holding on to this somehow and winning. I don't know how, but we are. Alright. Keep it up. We're doing great. Now, I don't know that the major thing is... Uh, I don't believe that a major aspect of this involves the these guys, the Red Singers, but maybe I like to pretend like it does. Makes me feel a little bit better. Here we go. Oh, no. Didn't quite get these guys back as, as much as I wanted to. Let's go ahead and dish out some pain here. There you go. Pain! Pain with the Red Stinger! We got it. We won! Guys, thank you so much for watching. This video showcases the Red Stinger throughout all the eras of Plants vs. Zombies 2. Uh, if you want to see more of the Red Stinger in the, uh, in the Lost City, be sure to check out the previous three videos. I do thank you guys once more for being here. Come back next time. And uh, goodbye. Goodbye. And uh, next time we'll show off the AKEE, -E, I believe. I think that's what we're going to show off. Then the next episode will be the Endurian. Uh, so we showed them off all the eras. Goodbye, my friends. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching. Check out more of my videos. And if you want to find me on your favorite social network, check the links in the description. And here's Otto. That's Egon. Those are my cats.